Chris here from the Cigar Federation, coming to you from an undisclosed location. And it is relatively dark outside because we got to get the smoke on. This is the cigar of the evening. This is the knockout TLC. This thing's so dang good, it'll hit you all the way to your grandchildren good. That's how good this cigar is. Whew. They just touched my clackers. <laughs> they take the hat off and see if that is well. Well, we're having hat day. I know, but do this one without the hat. We got the Robusto. And then we're gonna smoke this girl. Chris, what do you think about this? I think it's fine. I think we're gonna get the smoke on. It's ready to punch it, light it up. I've already been making out. Oh. Since this is the uh, the knockout, we're gonna punch it. <laughs> and I heard a rumor that this has a Connecticut broadleaf Maduro wrapper, which is tasty. It's it's zesty, but it's smooth. Warm, but it's cold. It's black, but it's white. It's the yin and the yang. Inside this this fine stick has a Nicaraguan Honduran. I think Dominican is in there. I think. I'm really enjoying this. Getting into about an inch. It's got a good ash going here. It's got a fairly smooth burn. This cigar is so good. It's gonna beat you up and take your lunch money. It just says something. I just love the Nicky. I just love that Nicaraguan. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the ash. Got that nice salt and pepper. You can see a little bit of the veins going on. Definitely holding tight. It's so good. Well, after you exhale, I want to go back and get the smoke. I want to draw it back in. Oh, that's recycling because smoking cigars is good for the earth. You know what I needed was I needed the Fonseca TV to get my groove on. Get your head right? Yeah. Okay. That's, that's, like, just a, a that's like a mystical playground right there. That's this is so good, it'll make you want to smoke your cigar like that. It's going to make you want to eat. It's going to make you want to chew on it. You're going to want to gnarl on it. You're going to want to make out with it. So flavor-wise on this particular smoke, uh, initially you get the earth, you get a lot of dark chocolate in it. Mm. Uh, I mean, really, really good dark chocolate. Not that cheap kind of stuff you go get at the store that's, you know, on sale. No, I'm talking you gotta go drop some money because you're in trouble and you gotta go buy your way back out of a kind of dark chocolate. A lot of uh, really nice floral undertones. The floral that tastes like a really nice aged, mm -hmm. herbally It's beautiful. got character and it leaves this gotta get more on your tongue after you blow the smoke out and the creaminess lingers a little bit and then just gone. Check this out under 10 bucks retail. Say it ain't so. It is. Say it ain't. Oh, oh, it's so. California it's prices too. Yeah. California. We're, in, we're in California doing this right here. This is it. I'm telling you right now. I'm not making a lot of sense, but that's okay because I'm in a state of tobacconist only euphoria right now. Oh, that <laughs> burned. You see that ash? Yeah. I think he got so jittery and excited that he just dumped it early. It happens. Sometimes. He hadn't smoked one in a while. You get excited about it. Oh! You lost it. No, mine's longer than yours. Okay, the Cigar Federation official rating for the knockout TOC tobacconist only cigar is 93. Excellent cigar. You're definitely going to want to get boxes of the knockout. Good stick. You just touched my clackers. Thank you.